Firstly, John, welcome to the club. You must be happy to get the deal over the line. Yep, um, definitely happy to get it over the line. Um, it's been it's been a long, long off season for me. Um, I've worked hard to get to, the, to get to this position, fitness wise, and um, just happy to get it sorted. How did the deal initially come about? Um, I think the manager obviously spoke to my agent and said, you know, we'll have a look at him and the situation I was in, being injured for a while, I was always going to come in and you know train, train for a week or two to see how it was, and um, I was just I was happy to be here as soon as I came really. What were the main attractions that made you want to sign for the club? I think I think the size of the club really, massive club, isn't it? Um, obviously the facilities, top notch, couldn't ask for any more really. And what did the manager say to you to convince you to make the move? Well, he sold he sold the whole the whole thing to me, you know, the project and how how he wants to go about getting out of this league. And um, I think I think obviously me personally, you don't want to be you don't want to be playing in League Two, do you? And I think the manager the manager's the same. He wants to take this club forward. He thinks he thinks the club's uh, definitely big enough, you know, to to climb the leagues and uh, the stature of it. Um, so yeah, just just sold it to me really. You've been training with us for around a week now. What's it been like? It's been tough. Tramia, Tramia running club, I think. But it's been enjoyable. Um, yeah, I've enjoyed it being in since last Monday. So it's coming up to two weeks now. Yeah, the lads are all, all boss. Um, training's been good, but it's been tough. You've had plenty of experience. Haven't played in League One in the Championship before, and haven't spent a few months last season at Bristol Rovers. So you know what it takes to get out of this league. Yeah, well, being being at Bristol, that was the first time I, you know, experienced anything about League Two, and um, I think the way they went about it was was spot on. Um, the way they played, you know, attractive style of football. I think these this, um, you know, this, this people think you've got to you've got to play a certain ugly way to get out of League Two, but I think I think Bristol proved proved that wrong. For anyone who might not have seen you play before, can you tell us a little bit about your style of play? I hate this question. Uh, I, I think I'm, I'm just a good footballer, um, and, I've, uh, and, and I'm a runner. So hopefully I can, you know, chip in with a few goals and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I'm a good footballer. Do you have any personal and team targets set for the season? I think we've, we've got to get promoted, haven't we? I think that's that's the main one and the only one, really. Yep. As we mentioned earlier, you've been in and around the training ground in the group for the last nearly like two weeks. So you must be looking forward to just focusing on the season ahead now and getting stuck in. Definitely, yeah. The first two weeks has obviously just been tough running, but we've got a game on Saturday, haven't we? So I think that's um, where everything starts clicking and getting into gear. As I said before, the lads lads are spot on. Good group here and um, I've seen quality on, on the training pitch already. So I'm confident, I'm confident that we can do something special this season.